trying to think. Maybe in 2010, it turned into motorcycle towing. And before that, it was, I had a van, and then uh, and I started just doing towing only, because I was still doing some stuff, moving boxes and stuff, but it just, for some reason, there's not a lot of jobs with the van, and, and so, I was looking at a van for sale, and the guy's an asshole because he's asking a certain amount for it. And I told him I'll give you less money, and he's saying, "No, he wants the full amount." And I'm like thinking, "Why would you want the full amount? The van is not brand new; it's 20 years old." And yeah. What if I have trouble with the van? I need the extra 500 so I can have it fixed, which is always the case. When you buy an old 20 year old truck, you're gonna run into instantly, you're gonna run into $500. At least. Yeah, at least instantly. And every truck that's old, you have to fix it. And, you know, it's not it's not all money coming in. You have to spend money fixing it. And now he's starting to lighten up because he lied to me and he said there were so many people that wanted it. And I was trying to tell him that everybody would say that to you. But they won't actually give you money. Yeah. And then... Um, he could just be saying that to you, too. Maybe he, you're the only caller. He's just saying that no, to no, you. No, no, no. It's a good looking... It's a oh. nice looking man, but... Um, the reason I'm also hesitating is because it's a really big man. Oh. And, uh, you know, it's got a real... It just, like... It eats a lot of gas, but... Eight something? Yeah, but it's still... It's still worth it for me to have the man if I could get some kind of jobs with it because you know I get my money back from using it but um, I haven't figured out how to what I make plan is yet because the van has seats in it and I don't really want to take out the seats because when you take out all the seats you're not allowed to park on the street really? yeah there's a lot of laws that people don't know about who don't do man with a van but people who do man with a van know all these laws and then, um, if you, if you, uh, you know, I could take out some of the seats, but then if you think about it, if I take out some of the seats, I end up, I end up throwing my seats in the garbage can, and it would be so much nicer if I didn't have to throw out the seats, because, you know, it's kind of nice to have a van that has a lot of passenger seat inside, and, and if I could tell people that are moving stuff, if I could say, hey, you know, just put your stuff on the seats and then I wouldn't have to carry big things. But that's what people...